Welcome. We are going to take a look at what is new in Obsidian uh, 0.5.2 quickly uh, because there's some new stuff and it just came out about 20 minutes ago. First thing I want to do is I've remapped this to some key commands, shift command S for me because that's what I like, but you can also go up here and we can go more options. I'm going to split horizontally as well. Actually, I'm not going to do that. First thing I'm going to do is create a new note here, new stuff to show that off, and then I'm going to go split horizontally, which I also have mapped to a new thing. So let's start off with highlights. So we can now do block math, uh, although it's not 100% in here yet. Uh, there's a few issues with it, right? I can go dollar sign, dollar sign. I can do some math to plus three oh, equals five. And we can do our double dollar signs again, and we should get it. So down here, I'll click to preview. So you can see that's how it's going to look. Something it doesn't do right now is if I want to do like multi-line 10 plus 1 equals oh, equals 11. So it's not going to do multi-line for us. In fact, it's not even going to do multi-line if we do that. Still want multi-line. You have to put something between, something between, and put a little gap. Now I have multi-line block math. That's cool. New thing. Uh, next thing it's going to do is it's going to give us, oh, that's not what I really don't want. I want, let's go PHP, PHP. Let's just do dollar sign something equals foo. And then three backticks again. It does that. And we have some syntax highlighting for it. So that's nice. We also do HTML. I'm sure a bunch of other languages, though I did not look up exactly which languages I'm going to do. Section thing minus section. There's another one for us. So now I just have some syntax highlighting, which is cool. Another thing you can do now is you can embed uh, right here, right? V viewing and embedding web M4 aug and video and GIFs. And so let's grab a GIF that I prepared. Oh, well, I deleted the whole thing. So let's just download it again from Firefox. This one, because why not that one? Save image as, it's a GIF. Save. I'm going to grab it, and you actually see over here, and I'll show you this in a second if it doesn't show up right away, but I'm going to grab Giphy, and I'm going to go back to Obsidian, drop it in. You see we have a preview here as well. And if we go back to our finder, you can see that they've actually imported it into your group of markdown files, because Obsidian is just a bunch of markdown files. That's it. And we have our embedded GIF. Perfect. And it still is going to keep it in there, even if I don't reference it anymore. Great. The last two, we need to actually enable a plugin. So there's a bug right now, which I already brought up and they knew about where I can hit this and they hit star, which is the new thing. But now it hits star and it's unstar. But notice I have no idea just where to see my stuff. So under plugins, we can go in and we're going to hit starred. And now I can see my starred notes. All in is starred. Remove. If you want keyboard commands for that, you can go to your hotkeys and down near the bottom. Oh, it's blank. I thought I'd already set that. So star, I'm going to hit control S. I wish this just toggled. Shift control S. It'd be nice if this just toggled. So I could hit control S, control S, and it would just work. So I thought I had already done that. Now I can go in and I could look for oh, what I'm reading. The second mountain is the book I'm reading. So I hit control S. Now it's starred. And we can go over here and hit see if my kids come in because I'm currently watching them too. Uh, best research app, which is kind of how I found this. So I hit control S and now I've got them both in there. And the final one I think we're going to look at, let's open this. We're going to go 5.2. That's going to bring it up is the random note. It has also a smaller font. This font's fine for me. I was worried because I'm getting older and I need reading glasses sometimes, but that seemed fine. So in our plugins, we're going to go to random note. This is if you want to like learn more, get your notes, you can open random note. Open a book that I haven't read yet. <laughs> That's the first note it's going to open, right? Or open stuff on Noto, which is my note. Or my, one of the I, the note-taking apps, apps that I'm looking at. Or One Extraordinary Marriage, whatever. That's good. Let's go back. Command O to do that. And let's open up uh, 5.2 again. That's it. And then they fixed some issues, fixed page preview stuck when switching between files. I've seen that uh, for searching files, fixed 
just fixed a bunch of other bugs. So like I literally downloaded Obsidian two days ago. Yesterday I got an update. I think today I got an update. Like I got, I downloaded 5.0. I got 5.1 yesterday and I got 5.2 today. So, or 0.5.2. Lots of good developments in it. Very excited about this app. One or two things that I kind of think I would like. Uh, one thing which I showed in a previous video is you can't like filter this. It just sees everything, which isn't wonderful. Uh, I'd love to be able to filter down steps and you can't like zoom or anything with this. I can scroll. That's it. Um, so this, I think, will just get overwhelming pretty quick. Um, that's one of the things that also in transclusion, which is super nerdy. <laughs> transclusion, uh, where if I hit best research app and if I was to go to Rome research, hit command E. So it should show, it'll show that I've linked to it uh, from this, the best research app, but it doesn't actually like include it down here um, like it does in, in Rome or in... What else did I look at? Uh, Tiddly Roam, it does that as well. And it does not do it here. Love those two things. If we had that, then I think I'd almost be willing to stop my uh, my search for a note-taking knowledge management app if we had those two things. But we're not quite there yet. It's only been around for a couple months, though. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, you can subscribe below if you loved it. Give me a thumbs up, all that stuff. I totally did that backwards like I always do. And if you really love it, then you can go to... Oh, here's my kid. Then you can go to uh, patreon.com slash Curtis McHale and support me. Do you want to say hi for a second? Come here. Yeah, I know you got shoes. Just look up. Look at the camera and say hi. Hey. Now say bye. <laughs>